Thanks for watching this introductory video tutorial for Amaris Stitcher. My name is Meredith Price and I'm the Amaris Product Manager. Amaris Stitcher is a program for stitching overlapping 2D, 3D, and 4D tiles in X, Y, and Z. The software loads image tiles using stage coordinates, provides a preview of those tiles and their arrangement, aligns the tiles, and then finally stitches them together into one large image. Today I will walk you through loading non-Amaris as well as Amaris files as tiles. I'll then show you the basic steps of aligning those tiles based on their overlapping content, and lastly, how to stitch those tiles together and open the stitched image within Amaris. First, I'll start Amaris Stitcher. I want to load a lift file which contains tiles that make up three images. Because Amaris Stitcher only accepts Amaris files, the best way to handle other types of files is to either convert the file ahead of time with Amaris File Converter or drag and drop the file into the Amaris Stitcher window. You can see that once I drop the file, Amaris File Converter appears and the image is automatically loaded there. And then I hit Start All to begin the conversion. Once the files are converted into Amaris files, I can drop them into Stitcher. I'll show you this next step with a different set of tiles. Here I'm loading a demo set of image tiles. You can see that the stage coordinates are red and the tiles are arranged for a preview quickly and correctly. A 3D maximum intensity projection view is immediately available and I can zoom into tiles and pan around the field. The next step is to align the neighboring tiles to one another based on the image content. Here I'm selecting Align All Images, but you have the option to select a subset of tiles and align only that selection. After the alignment, you can again inspect the tiles with the 3D view. In the bottom right hand corner, you can turn on and off the image borders for each tile. You can also switch to a slice view. The slider for moving up and down through the Z planes is on the left side of the image window. And finally, you can click the Save button to stitch the image tiles together and open the resulting file within Amaris. Once the file is saved, Amaris will automatically open and your file is loaded. Now you can visualize and analyze your image using Amaris. Thanks again for watching this tutorial and please let us know if you have any questions.